Hello to you on a cracking night here at the Theatre of Dreams, Old Trafford. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, at the microphone. And sitting alongside me is the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It's Manchester United up against Crystal Palace. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. The lineup for Manchester United. David De Gea between the posts. Jadon Sancho plays with Anthony out wide. And the focal point in attack today, Marcus Rashford. And here's the Palace 11. Jeffrey Schlup starts alongside Eberechi Eze in central midfield. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. And now they get the ball rolling. No, high quality defending. Well, the pass not finding its target. Ericsson. And here is Malassia. And space to cross it. Oh, he's lost possession. And Palace will get the throw in. Here's a change for Manchester United. under some pressure and no problems whatsoever for the goalkeeper ball's gone I'm sure Stuart the video analysis will have identified Marcus Rashford as one of the main threats they've got to deal with well Derek whether he's on the run driven a shot hitting a volley or even shooting with the inside of his foot he strikes the ball with such power and this is why he beats the goalkeeper so often he's a tremendous striker of the ball Cristiano Ronaldo Jadon Sancho Return to Ronaldo. Can they cover up? Danger averted for now. Well, not giving him any breathing room. Good work to win the ball back by United. And in with a real chance. There it is. The opening goal of this match. And what a start they've made. Well, let's look at this again. And the keeper just lost his bearings there. He was never in the right position. He won't want to see that again. Goal for 
And the action underway again. The onus very much on Palace to find a response now. Teammates available. Bruno Fernandes. A gift for any goalkeeper. Could cross it in here. Oh, beating his opponent with ease. And the keeper not really taxed by that long-range shot. Eccentric goalkeeping. And the free kick awarded to Manchester United. Well, no card, but I think he can consider himself suitably warned. Plenty of support here. Well, didn't go to plan in the end. Cristiano Ronaldo. Possession lost. It is a decent looking attack here. Couldn't find a teammate. Throw in here. Bruno Fernandes. Chance to play it in. Well, he made that interception look routine. In truth, it wasn't. Oh, and nearly on target. Not quite, though. Yeah, very nearly, but the goalkeeper had it covered. It wasn't really a great effort. Plenty of support here. Can he finish? Well, United very much in control over the last 15 minutes and their passing patterns have created numerous chances. They surely must extend their lead soon. Now, let's see what they can do here. In with a chance! And a goal! They're going to take some stopping now. Two in front here. Well, here's the replay, and I have to say, the keeper's got his angles all wrong there. That's a poor piece of goalkeeping. So back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. Ericsson, he put it in, and just narrowly wide in the end. over the touchline for what will be a Palace throw he continues his run but it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending
for Nansch. On the offensive. And the ball back with Palace now. Sancho. Bruno Fernandes. And a goal! To increase their advantage to three. Can they be stopped? Well, as you can see, he just about gets that right. Some would say it's slightly lucky. I would say it's perfect placement. So the action underway once more, and it's beginning to look as though it's a case of how many for United. Well, the supporters think it's on. No way through. Has time to get the shot off. Well, I think you could call that an escape. It looked a certain goal. That's very effective. Good high pressing. Good bit of pressing. Chance here. It must go in, surely. Well, here's the replay, and he's got to clear his lines there. He doesn't do that. He has his pocket picked, and he's been rightly punished. Poor defending. Blistering first half display, and just look at that score. United have it once again. Cristiano Ronaldo. And that was simply miles off target. Well, I think he's right to go for power, but he's made the wrong connection, and it's really poor technique in the end. Out of play then, and a Palace throw in forthcoming. Running with the ball confidently. We're making high pressing work for them here. And the referee is going to add on four added minutes. United finding space on the wing. the shot and that's a straightforward stop and after that fantastic effort it's gone out for a throw in he's in with a chance can he finish and a decent save full credit
gives it a go. Well, that was quality. Last ditch defending. Corner once more. Happy to take on the shot. And there is the goal to make it a hat-trick. Excellence in finishing, there for all to see. Well, here it is again. It was a good finish, but the keeper has to do better at his near post. He was beaten far too easily on that occasion. So no more time left. That concludes the first half here at the Theatre of Dreams. Well, I must say, Bruno Fernandes having a great game out there. He's been quite the handful for those defenders. Well, what can you say about him today? He's been a real live wire. Full of tricks, great feet and good goals as well. Top stuff. And the match gets underway here at Old Trafford. Let's hope we're in for something special. So back underway and an intriguing second half in prospect. And no problems whatsoever for the goalkeeper. Lost possession, long-range effort, and he's done well to tip it over the bar. Corner kick forthcoming. Well, no problems defensively. And given away. And he has options available. Trying his luck from long range. And it's fallen for Ronaldo. Real defensive resilience. Ronaldo. And it's teed up for Ronaldo. And up for grabs off the keeper. And he finds the net. He could hardly miss. Well, let's take another look. If you lose the ball in those areas, you're going to get punished. And that's exactly what happened there. Well, it's an out and out pasting. 6 0. A real opening now. Rashford couldn't keep it. Good use of advantage in United's favour. Great strong tackle, throw in forthcoming. So making the substitution now. Jeffrey Schlupp to be replaced by number 19, Will Hughes. Ezzy. Needs to tread carefully. Fernandes. Well, sitting deep like this might be a dangerous game. He's in behind. The well, last gas defending, but brilliant defending. Jaden Sancho. 
Now, who can he play it to? Sancho! Oh, there it is! It's one goal after another, and it speaks to the quality of that performance. Well, it's a very simple finish in the end, but his movement was really good. He just found himself a bit of space in the box when it mattered most. Well, we're underway again, and this game was finished as a contest a long time ago. And I think, unfortunately for him, the less said about that attempt, the better. Well, he had a lot of options there, but he's chosen the wrong one. That was a poor effort. Good tackle. And he's through here. And read the danger magnificently. Well, if he gets this wrong, a penalty and a sending off. But he was spot on with his challenge. And intercepted there. The supporters want to see him have a go. Can he do it from miles out? Well, there it is. United have had most of the ball and they've made good use of it. They really have played some good attacking football and they look like scoring more. Oh, what an opportunity. Well, it really wasn't a great effort, was it? Splendid tackle and a throw in coming up. And time for the change now. Intense pressure. Not advantage with them. Referee says play on. Teammates available. Giving it a try. Superb block. Cristiano Ronaldo. This is Varane. What a shot from miles out. Well, he just couldn't make it happen. Twenty minutes to go. And a strong tackle. Might be a chance here. Well, what an opportunity, but really good defending, you've got to say. Showing a real desire to win it back. Decent effort there. Well, he has such good technique. He really did hit that well. He certainly came close there. And Palace doing well to regain possession. Trying to really get at the opposition here. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Now well, we're inside the final 15 minutes. And support available. The tackle, vivacious from Varane. Rashford. And in with a real chance. Well, negligent in front of goal, 
No two ways about that. But now we see that the offside flag has gone up. Well, as we approach full time in this one, Stuart, no escaping the conclusion that United are bossing this. Well, what an excellent performance. This is. Oh, the crossbar is still reverberating. Well, it looks so threatening, but the danger averted. Now, well, a good tackle. Rashford. No worries for the keeper. And Palace unable to retain possession. Eriksen. Bruno Fernandes. Well, far too much elevation there. Ducouré. Clean challenge. Bruno Fernandes. And he might be through here. And quite simply, wide of the target. And that'll be a Palace throw-in. Might really be able to trouble them here. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. And the referee has decided to add on a minimum of five minutes. And that's a straightforward stop. Will Hughes. Oh, that's a really good authoritative tackle. Throw in here. Lisandro Martinez. This is Varane. Can he do it from miles out? And the referee blows for full time. Positives for Manchester United. Three points for them. What did you make of it all? You're absolutely right, Derek. Their attacking play was excellent. Full of energy and pace. And the midfield completely dominated the game. It was a great all-round performance. Good work to win the ball back by...